I'm confused why he's not why he's available on a Saturday. Unless I'm just completely forgetting his normal uh, mm -hmm. schedule. Let me guess. You've got more to sing about? I didn't eat my lunch one summer day, embarrassed by how boring it was. Mum got worried, but I was stubborn, asked her why I'd want to eat this. She just gave me a sad smile. Still can't say I'm sorry. Maybe I should have gone home for the Bon holiday. No, I'm getting soft. I came out here to make it big. I can't I couldn't tell if he was trying to make that like a song or if he was just talking. Mm -hmm. Medjed's going to attack? Man, can't Team Spidey and Medjed just chill out and have some beers like they're birds? Yeah, but here's the thing, man. Beer tastes like shit. Hot take. Aight, aight, aight. Let me drop some knowledge on you, buddy. We're owning the summer break, man. We're doing it right, bird. <laughs> uh, 8.22. Oh. The day after. Really. Hi. Sure, I've got money to fucking burn. Let's see if we can get lucky. Well, then. Do, 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 do. Oh, man. Do, 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 do. Oh, man. Okay, come on. Do, do, do. Fuck you. Do, do, do. I'm surprised to see you, Executive Director. I thought you were on vacation in Europe. The company ordered me to return. I'm sure you're aware of the actions Medjet is taking. The hacking incident, yes. Are we being targeted now? We must prepare for the worst. The initial response is crucial in these types of situations. Everyone. Sup, my dude. Facing civic disorder and economic uncertainty, our citizens are in turmoil. It is imperative that we resolve the situation, and social reform must be led by the government. However, who can the people currently depend on? Yes, the Phantom Thieves. The fact that they're being lionized is proof that the government is malfunctioning. The mismanagement by authority figures is what has led us to this terrible condition. Good evening. Oh, Parker-kun. What kind of friends do you spend your time with? You can withstand difficult times if you have friends who support you through them. I'll be giving a speech again today. I'd also like you to come with me somewhere after the speech. What's your availability like today? Do, do, do. Actually... Actually... Diet Man Matsushita asked me to meet after this. You remember how he asked me to become his right-hand man? Well, he likely wants my answer. I'll need you to come with me after the speech. What's wrong? Ah, yes, to this dingy fucking tunnel? Sounds like a plan. What did you ask me here to discuss? I heard you met with Kuramoto's grandson. You have your ears to the ground, huh? And to think that he's the candidate the party is backing to ruin my chances of winning. I'll be completely straight with you, since I already asked you to be my right-hand man. We're currently fighting the Kuramoto group. What? You're fighting with Mr. Kuramoto? I have ambitions of my own, you know. I owe him for all he did for me, but I don't want to have I don't want him to have influence over me forever. All the more now that he's secretly working with diet members from other parties. I know he asked you to join his group, but I think you should decline his offer. Hmm. They want to keep you on a leash so you won't reveal any damaging information. The real culprit of the expense misappropriation case you were blamed for is old man Kuramoto. What in the world? What did you say? I searched through the party's off-the-record accounts from 20 years ago. There's no doubt. Can you still forgive him? He led you into the political world and kicked you out in the worst way. But why? Seems he brought his popularity and... or bought his popularity and as a result he was having some serious financial trouble. I see. It sounds as if you're saying that this is my opportunity to clear my name. And so you need an answer from me on whether I'll... or whether or not I'll be your right-hand man, yes? His own grandson has already tried to persuade you. Therefore, I can't wait any longer. If you join me, you can accuse Kuramoto of his crime. You can clear your name and put no good Tora behind you. This is your best and last chance. Join with Matsushita and take my revenge against Mr. Kuramoto, but drop out of the election. Don't do it. Hmm. I see. So that's how you truly feel about this. Matsushita, I appreciate the offer, but I must refuse. You have no conceivable reason to refuse. 
My goal is to become a member of the Diet, not a right-hand man. I will not cast aside my beliefs. On that, I stand firm. This information would be the deciding factor in taking down Kuramoto. I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. I was simply offering you a deal. I assumed you might decline it. Very well. Please forget it. I apologize for bringing it up so suddenly. I'll talk to the party and provide support for your next speech about the Phantom Thieves. Hmm? Why are you doing this? I don't want to debate about the Phantom Thieves. I simply want to draw attention to them. And you can assert your innocence there on a grand stage. To be frank, I'll be happy as long as the Kuramoto group's influence diminishes. Parker-kun, don't speak a word of this to anyone, for both our sakes. Very well, then. <sighs> it feels like I'm caught in the crossfire of a political conspiracy. My friend is trying to take advantage of me, while my former mentor is trying to win me over. To achieve my dream, I have to set aside my beliefs. What should I do? Stick to your beliefs. Yes. You're right. Betraying myself means betraying my supporters, which also means betraying you. For some reason, just talking with you always helps me make up my mind. It's as if my heart is being manipulated. Hmm. Perhaps. If the Phantom Thieves truly do exist, then I'm sure they're very much like you. More than you know, man. For some reason, you stood by me, no good Tora, who didn't have any supporters. Actually, I've been thinking about this for a while, actually. You must have experienced cruelty and injustice in this life. I can tell by the look in your eyes. That's why I sense your desire to help the weak. And the strength to stand up to the hecklers, to Matsushita, and to Kuramoto's grandson. You're no ordinary high school student. Even I know that much. Hey. Would you care to talk about it? So he's figuring it out. Is that is that what we're uh, realizing here? So what if you're right? <laughs> Just a joke. Haha, <laughs> sorry. I crossed the line there. I've always lacked restraint in these situations. See what I did there? I relieved the tension by making fun of myself. Think of it as an advanced technique for winning people over. I feel like my bond is growing deeper. Level 8. Mind control occasionally lets you skip negotiation when attempting to obtain a persona. Right. Nice, because fuck negotiation. Love to see All it. Right. All right then. Well, at least I'm... I'll at least make good use of Matsu Matsushita's help setting up my next speech. I feel like I'll be able to fully express my beliefs if you're there I with shall me. Ask you again another we time. can discuss it again at the speech. My charm has increased. Bing! Well then, I'll see you again. Good work today. Pee 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 pee. Thank you for tagging along today. Goodness, I've gotten you all wrapped up in my whole messy past now. I told you before, becoming a diet member shouldn't be your only goal in life. I still stand by those words, of course, but what are your thoughts on what happened today? Say you were in my shoes. Could you say with all confidence that you wouldn't be swayed by such a lucrative deal? Humans are easily swayed. One glimpse of a temptation could be all it takes to make us forget our principles. That is why you must never forget what's truly important to you. You understand? I'll never forget that. Good. Life is full of tough decisions. I can only hope today's lesson will nourish your growth. Well, the real battle begins now. I need to devote myself to this fully. After all, I can hardly afford to disappoint you. All right, see you next time. I'll be counting on you. Nice. Here we go. Tomorrow's the day, isn't it? Are the Phantom Thieves even doing anything? Hey, what are we going to do? I should never have trusted the Phantom Thieves. What's going to happen tomorrow? We're all going to die. The 21st. Today's supposed to be the day Medjed's attacking, right? 
I guess there's nothing the Phantom Thieves could do. Medjed must have been too much for them. Stock prices are plummeting again. Maybe Medjed's true goal was... Isn't today our deadline for dealing with Medjed? Sure Utana's is. still asleep too. This won't be good. Hey. So, how's Futaba? Same as always. Today is the day Wakaba passed. I do this every year. Here, I've got a cup for you too. Futaba reminds me so much of her mother. She's a smart girl. Doesn't just go with the flow either. Wakaba. Your work and your kid were so fulfilling for him. Why'd you have to die so suddenly? That reminds me. You saw me talking to that prosecutor. I, I mean, that woman in the suit, right? Sure did. I remember you were real bothered by it. She might come back. So I guess I should tell you about it. Give me the hot and juicy goss, my dude. That woman was trying to get information on Wakaba's research out of me. That's what we heard in the palace. You don't need to know what the research was about. Just know there was some trouble around it. Obviously, Wakaba got dragged into that as well. Now, they ruled her death a suicide. But I've got my doubts. Doubts? Could she have been killed? That's Supposedly, my thought. There were people who wanted to take her research and use it for their own benefit. Don't get me wrong, though. I don't have a lick of evidence. That's why I haven't told Futaba any of this. I don't want to cause her any more trouble. It sounded like she had suspicions of her own based on what she said in the palace. Still, there's one thing I regret. It was right before Wakaba died. She told me, I think I might die. I brushed it off thinking it was just a joke. But if I had just taken her seriously... <sighs> That's another reason I took Futaba in. Redemption. She went through such horrible things. Those heartless adults just yelled at the poor girl. Hey, how do you heal emotional scars? Ain't that a question. I don't know, man. Of course. Uh, sorry. Futaba! Hey! How long has it been since you were out of the house? It's cold. Uh, uh, huh? You can't sell this. <laughs> no, never mind that. What? How did you get here? Uh, I walked. <laughs> You're okay? Was that bad? Uh, th that's not it. I'm just shocked to see you out of the house. Uh, I'm sorry I worried you. <laughs> oh, my dude's crying. <laughs> it's alright. By the way, what's the date today? Yeah, about that. It's the 21st. Uh, it's, uh, it's the 21st. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Yeah, you might be. You know, the cleanse. Oh, I remember now. Majed. Let's take care of it now. Come. Just, just like that? <laughs> Is it going to be easy for you? Like, just... Oh, yeah, let's just take care of Medjed. Let's just, yeah, you know, no bother. Apparently some ATMs aren't working. I heard someone's tampering with the system. Is it Medjed? No, it couldn't be. What are the police doing? They're so incompetent. Even the Phantom Thieves couldn't stop them. It's my turn to help out. <laughs> Medjed. Now how do we cook them? It's up to you. 
Roger that. Hey, Futaba. We don't have much time left. Are you sure you could do this? The, the kitty talked? Uh, of course. She's been in the palace now. Is this a dream? <laughs> I'm going back to sleep. No! It is not a dream! Get up! Say something! He's a talking cat. R right. Now hurry it up! Eh, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's get huh? cracking. Hi, oh, yeah, it's just a talking cat. It doesn't matter. You're just tapping away over there. Are you sure this will work? Mm -hmm. Hey, Futaba! <laughs> <laughs> She's in the zone. I don't think she can hear me. Talk about intense concentration. This place is so messy. I'm surprised she could focus at all. Futaba, you should really clean your room a bit. Huh. She's not listening. Oh well. Just waiting around is boring. Let's clean the place up. <laughs> really? <laughs> Whew. It looks a little better now, don't you think? Well, Futaba, we're done on our end. Are you finished yet? <laughs> she can't hear a word I'm saying. <sighs> Guess we'll just have to keep waiting. <sighs> I'm done! Uh, what's up? Something happened? It's finished. Is she wearing a Tetris shirt? Finished? What is? <gasps> it's so clean! Why? <laughs> We cleaned it. Anyway, is it true? Did you really take care of Medjed? I handled them, and someone else handled my room. I don't understand, but this is good. <laughs> oh, I love her. Futaba? I, I just pass this out. Futaba, what's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's great. She's sleeping. Well, it looks like it's been taken care of. I guess we should get home and sleep too. Definitely, definitely a new challenger in the Waifu Wars. We've had one elimination so far, which is on. I heard the bank servers got taken over. That has to be fake, right? There's no way. I'm scared. What's going to happen? Are the police taking action? They're ignoring it? Seriously? Yeah, it's the police. What do you expect? Still, I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will do something. P P P. So, Futaba's awake? Awesome! And has Medjed been taken care of? Uh, more importantly, how's Futaba doing? She's in her futon? I don't know what that is. She's back asleep. Seriously? She must have been quite exhausted. I can't say I blame her at all. If Medjed's been affected, it will surely make the news. That should be enough to confirm whether or not the deed's been done. Then why don't we all watch the news together? Yes, we should meet up at LeBlanc as usual. I remembered to call it LeBlanc and not LeBlanc. See you tomorrow, guys. We should be in the clear now, right? Be proud of me. Bum, bum, bum. <sighs> Do -do -do. I don't know, maybe it'd be better if we just stayed in today. I have something. Do 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 do. Let's watch the news. Today is the day Medjed has said it will attack the city, and panic has spread throughout the city. Ah, uh, what? The, I, I keep doing this. I, I just some my brain just looks at the line below the one I'm reading and adds words from it into the line I'm reading. So I said attack the city, but the city is the next line down. That's the uh, blah 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 blah. You, yeah, annoying. I keep doing it. I, my brain just it like gets ahead of my mouth, and then my mouth says the thing too early. Some citizens are trying to avoid going outdoors, and people have been in a constant state of worry. Many corporations have been working around the clock without sleep to prepare for the hmm. attack. Nothing's changed yet. All we can do now is pray. Man, it's hot. I don't have an appetite. Guess I'll just have Suman again. We can't go out, right? Hey! 
Can we call Kawakami over? Oh, interesting. I assumed it wouldn't let us. Yep. Let's make sure you close up. Hi. Let's get that done. Actually, ah, oh, fuck. I just realized I should have done it myself so that I can rank up. Uh, Sajiro. That was. This was actually a mistake. Feels bad. Oh well, whatever. There'll be another time. Let's finish the DVD. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is a reference to Prison Break, right? Damn it, they're onto us. We're out of time. Wait, just wait. Look at my back. See the map? If we take this route instead, we might stand a chance. <laughs> yeah, he tattooed the fucking prison layout onto his back, didn't he? It's been so long since I saw Prison Break. I didn't watch, wasn't there like a revival series or something? Didn't watch that. Probably was shit. There were a couple of good seasons. I think like, I think season one of Prison Break obviously is the best. Everyone, I think, is in agreement there. Season two was like, eh, less good, but still right. And then season three was back in another prison, which was interesting, but it wasn't as interesting as the first one. And then season four was dog shit. Absolute garbage. Oh my god. That's Detailed plan to escape prison, persuading the guards and making small gadgets. How do they think of all that? Don't know, ask the writers. Oh. So we finished watching Jailbreak, huh? And a thing or two about proficiency. Hmm. We love to see it. Okay. Let's go return the DVD well, soon. How the fuck have I still not got kindness and guts up to four? God damn it. Cheers, love. In the words of Tracer. Okay, 22nd. What's this? Are you serious? No way, I can't believe it. This is a joke, isn't it? They lost. How could this happen? Wait, what? What is occurring? Hey, your friends are here. Hurry what's down. Up? What up? <laughs> Why does he say what's up and the text is what up? So you're finally up, huh? Don't slack off just because you're on summer vacation. I would never. I slack off all the time, not just because I'm on summer vacation. Yo, you look tired. We've made ourselves at home. Late last night, it was discovered that someone has tampered with the hacker group Medjid's website. The site's main page now displays what is thought to be the mark belonging to the Phantom Thieves. Hey, we love to see More it. More so, the personal information of a Japanese man, a possible Medjid member, was illegally publicized. Lamau? Aren't these the guys people have been up in arms about? Medjid has yet to issue an official reply. Furthermore, their previously announced cleanse of Japan has remained unimplemented for now. Some speculate that they have taken this series of events seriously and ultimately cancelled their plan. Yeah. <laughs> yes! <sighs> Easy peasy. Something great happened. Well, stop it. You're gonna drive away all my customers. Ah, uh, yes, because you get so fucking many of them, don't you? Oh, wait. No, you don't. After the commercial break, we will be asking guests from various fields about this turn of events. Let me guess, Monsieur Akechi. But there ain't any customers. Damn <laughs> it. My customers are on summer vacation too. Yeah. Oh crap, I just realized our break's almost over. Feels bad. There are still 10 days left. I want to go somewhere, but we can't just leave Futabachan alone. Some things still concern me too. Like that research. Mmm. Futaba? Oh. Hey! Did you just get up? Good morning. <gasps> it seems she's cautious of us. <laughs> she's hiding behind me. Hey, uh, why don't we go upstairs? If any customers come, she'll be even more afraid. Why don't you go with them, Futaba? Have fun. 
It's about time my regulars show up anyway. So I don't want you guys loitering around my store. The fact that there were no damages due to the hacker's actions is but an afterthought. It's Mr. Dickhead. This is the prick that fucked us over, isn't it? The issue I want to make clear is the attitude of the police, and more importantly, the government. I can't wait to fucking smack that bald head of his. <sighs> it's gotta happen. There's no way. There's no way he's not the final boss. Or, well, maybe the original final boss, because Royal added another palace, right? Royal added, like, a whole extra semester and another palace and stuff, so... I assume this, that will be something separate because there's no way they would have, like, not wrapped up the story in the original main game, so. What yeah, do you we'll mean? Right, he's gotta be, Are right? Are they doing their best to find an effective countermeasure against these phantom thieves? Is it not the government's duty to create a society where its citizens can live without worry? Unfortunately, the current cabinet is powerless. As such, they should be disbanded. I believe now is the time for me to risk my political career in hope of making a new reality. A new political system that goes beyond parties or factions. An ideal country of peace and order. This politician seems quite promising. I feel like he looks evil just from... Like, you just look at him and you go... You fall somewhere on the scale between dickhead and evil. I have to agree... I hope he can work to ease the anxieties of the elderly. I've got bad news for you. What do you think, boss? Hmm? Oh, sorry. Uh, I wasn't listening. Oh, what's occurring? Flash, 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 flash. It's me, Sai! How's it going? So the Phantom Thieves only stole the heart of Futaba Sakura? And Mejid was in turn defeated by her real-world hacking abilities? This does correlate to the facts as we know them. If he's Funny telling that. the truth, then Wakaba Ishiki didn't commit suicide. Did a third party target her life with the goal of destroying her research? Wakaba's death was two years ago. That also coincides with when the incident started occurring. Oh, the... Like the people in the restaurant industry and stuff, and the train drivers? Does this other metaverse user that Madarame and Kaneshiro mentioned really exist? Yeah, I forgot about that. Earlier, I briefly mentioned about those psychotic breakdown incidents that have alarmed the public. All of a sudden, people will lose consciousness or become violent. A situation as incomprehensible as that can't be explained away as troubled social conditions. I suspect that these cases are all connected to a larger, man-made plot. It's all connected, man! The method involved always muddled the explication, but your story has virtually confirmed its viability. Although I wouldn't have expected a new criminal to come to light from your testimony. What did your group think of this other Metaverse user? Uh... The true criminal? How self-centered of you. Fuck the you. Phantom Thieves tamper with people's hearts without asking consent. How is that different? Because we make positive change and they make negative. <laughs> well, no matter how you thought of them, there can be no doubting your resolve. Are those incidents because of you or someone else? Either way, I will get to the bottom of this. I feel like my bond with Sai is growing deeper. Alright. Now, let's move on to your next crime. Kunikazu Okumura. Okie doke. You should know who he is, considering I what should. happened. Oh, right, because it's the future. <laughs> your testimony regarding this incident will be serious. I'm sure you understand why. Answer my next question carefully. What did you do to this Okumura? Summary of the story up to this point has been updated. Yeah. To think the cognitive version of a person would transform into such a horrible monster and attack us. 
That means our enemies aren't limited to shadows. I thought the other people were just victims. Like the slaves at the castle or the walking ATMs. Even though they seem to be alive, they're only part of the backdrop. The environment. In other words, the palace ruler determines the form and strength of their cognitions. I love how we're all sat in chairs in a circle and then Futaba's just on the bed off the side eating. <laughs> I would have loved to ask Futaba's mother how far along she was with her research. Hmm. Research, huh? She was looking into that cognitive science stuff, yeah? If we put together all the information we've gathered up to this point, abuse of cognitive science can lead to death, and it may even relate to the psychotic breakdown incidents. Considering the cognitive aspect, I sense a strong connection between it and the metaverse. On top of that, the research might have been stolen and used by someone else. You mean those guys that showed Futaba-chan the fake suicide note? If that is the case, those people are unforgivable. Hey, Futaba, is there anything else you can remember? <laughs> That's a no. She is quite difficult. <laughs> that smell. Come on, no fair. Hey, can I snag a bite? Meanie. <laughs> Meanie. Why don't we take a short break? I've been thinking. Don't strain yourself. Even if Futaba is a genius, could she really crush an international hacker organization that easily? Well, apparently. The one who taunted the Phantom Thieves was a guy in Japan. I knew the Medjed members in Japan weren't anything special, so I wasn't worried. How do you know that? Because I'm the founder. Oh? Excuse me? Um, what do you mean? Should we take that literally? Yep, it was only me at first, back when I was referred to as the hacker of justice. But since I stayed anonymous, a bunch of guys from all over the world started using the name. And those were the ones committing cyber crimes. It was a hassle to expose all of them, so I just left them be. Uh, so Futaba was the true Medjed and we were freaking out over some weak ass dipshits? You should have told us from the start, Futaba. I discarded the Medjed name a while ago. I'm Alibaba now. Futaba, what do you want to do now? Since you know our secret, we'd like you to join our team. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Just like that? This may even ensure our investigation of mementos goes along smoothly. Well, I guess. Well, Futaba's real amazing. She's gonna be a big help for us, huh? Yup. Say, Futaba. She is, like, quite a few levels behind everyone else, though. How did you find out about us? Secret. Where did you learn to hack? Secret. Private. Huh? <laughs> when did you obtain the nav? I refuse to answer. Futaba, come on. Futaba-chan sure is unique. Still, it'll be a problem if she doesn't open up to us some more. At the very least, we need to be able to communicate normally with her. <laughs> what should we do? Let's get to know her. How? First, we'll need to help her open up to us. If we each spend an entire day with her, maybe she'll get more used to being around us. I see. We do have the time thanks to summer vacation. We can begin tomorrow. Let's go to the beach. There'll be tons of people there. Plus, we got totally dried out in that desert. That's a great idea. I forgot I hadn't gone to the beach yet. Sweet. Sounds uh, good. Excuse me. I'll come by tomorrow. See you then. Let me help as well. I don't have anything planned. Thanks. We can set a schedule with everyone else, depending on when they're free. Okay! Can I really do this? 
It'll be a disaster. Good luck. Why me? Because you're a kitty. Stress Hello. is the enemy of beauty, you know. How can I stay calm about this? I understand how you feel. Thanks to the incident with those hackers, people are calling us incompetent. And on top of all that, the Phantom Thieves are claiming justice is on their side. Don't make me laugh. Mejet was dealt with by either the Phantom Thieves themselves, or some avid supporter. There are no tracks whatsoever, so they must be quite skilled. Either way, the general public recognizes the Phantom Thieves as the subjugating party. They're gaining support and influence much faster than we could have anticipated. It is indeed an abnormal situation. I'm beginning to suspect mass manipulation of some kind. It's even possible that a powerful person is behind them, plotting the psychotic breakdowns. If only I had realized sooner. Well, that's not the case, right? It's rare to hear you speak in that tone. For the sake of my justice, I won't forgive them. Interesting. Interesting. P P P P. Hey, I heard some people talking about us on the train home. They they were saying how awesome they think the Phantom Thieves are. I've heard things too. It's becoming a huge topic of conversation. To be fair, the casualties from a Medjet attack would have been massive. It's no surprise they revere us for preventing it. It was close though. Yeah. It's really all thanks to Alibaba. You were a great help. It was nothing. Oh, that reminds me. I need to think of a different voice. That that was too close to Arn's. I need to think of a voice for Futaba. I'm, I'm running out of voices <laughs> to do for the text message chats. Remember the, that stuff about ATMs and banks just stopping? That wasn't Nedjed, was it? I don't know. I can't. I can't think. It should be like fairly high pitched, but uh... no, that that was totally separate. Maybe I just sort of like quieter. I don't know. I'm I'm running out of ideas for voices. I'm <laughs> not a voice actor. So people were overreacting to mere coincidence. Either that, or those rumors were never true to begin with. Hmm. You seem to be quite talkative in these conversations. I is that so? I'll shut up then. <laughs> Emoji. Question mark? <laughs> I don't think I get it, but I'm pretty sure she's angry. You gotta apologize, Yusuke. Me? Why? <laughs> hey, is this really going to be okay? I'm worried about how things will be from now on. Every little thing's gonna be alright. <sighs> Training Futaba is going to be a lot of work. More than stealing someone's heart. P P P P. Now that's my Phantom Thieves. I knew they'd pull it off. This definitely proves the justice of the Phantom Thieves. You may be right. Right? It feels great. Even the guys who had been criticizing the Phantom Thieves basically have to accept them now. The news has been spreading like wildfire too. I'll give it an extra boost on my site on my site as well. I bet the approval rating will be through the roof tomorrow. Why is Look forward he to it. People getting excited about this? Cause he's machine. Well, the news really did draw a lot of attention. I can't wait to see what happens. Me either. Thieves Den updated. I have something. Lovely, jubbly. <sighs> Futaba's almost like some kind of shy cat. Even so, we should keep at it. Sure, sure. Okay, great stuff once again. We I'll collectively love to see it. Where are things going to go from here? I have no idea. I have no idea. It seems like uh, the dude, the main the main dickhead that got us fucked over at the beginning is planning his run for office. Uh, but I don't think that'll be next because we've still, like, this is like halfway through or something. So I assume he's going to be right at the end. We'll see. Um... 
So yeah, not sure. We've got the beach tomorrow. We're going to be trying to break down Futaba's walls, hopefully get her to open up a bit more with us and become a true sort of, you know, clear member of the team rather than sort of slightly off to the side that she is at the moment. That'd be great. Well, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I will see you next time for more Persona 5 Royal. Thanks for watching. See you then.